Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. So in today's video, we're gonna be carving pumpkins. I got the homegirl with me. She don't even need an introduction at this point. You already know who she is. The real Brandita. And that's on period, okay? So we're just gonna carve pumpkins, have some girl chat, and that's just that on that. Let's get right into this video. time I even carved a pumpkin okay we got the tools the supplies and we just gonna get to we gonna freestyle I don't even think we gonna even really use these stencils yeah they they have stencils I don't know if they had that back in the days but they give you stencils to pop out the eyes and stuff like that but we gonna freestyle yeah I think we just go yeah because we ain't got time for all them shenanigans no we don't yes. so let's just get right to oh, okay it. so I, I just know what tools to okay can I talk about this oh yeah go ahead so last time we had what mango yeah the mango and i am not sponsored by these people so no 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 we, we, we just this, like the beverage we, i'm just talking about what we had a mango mule this time we're having a grapefruit a grapefruit paloma no mm -hmm. name brand because i ain't gonna say it Cioso. okay that's it that's all i wanted to say and that's just that on that okay it's a little bit early in the daytime but you know what <laughs> We outside, it's chilly, we need to warm up our bones. Yes, okay. just to let you know, I know I'm looking a little bit crazy today. I got my work overalls on because I thought I was going to get a little messy. I had the beanie on. She coming Miss, prepared. No, but Miss Lena wanted to talk about that. I didn't wear my witch's hat, so I had to pull her back, hey. put her in. So, you know. We got to keep it festive. Okay, you got to get it how you're going to get it. And that's just that. Okay. Brandisha. What is yes. that dating pool looking like, girl? You dating anybody? You have any prospects? I mean... I mean, I got prospects that, you know, that I, you know, dream about. Oh! I mean, but if you're talking about somebody in actual, like... Yes, real life. I could touch, call, yes. say, hola, como estas? Okay, bien y tú? All of that, okay? okay? That would be a negative. Oh, a negative, honey. Okay, what about you? Okay. Next question. Girl, it's a no for me. It's, it's a no for me. Oh, why? Um, I'm taking a break <laughs> from the dating, okay? I feel like these guys out here, they be with the shenanigans, and I ain't here for it. I'm just not here for it. Um, you know, after being, like, you know, a single mom and dealing with shenanigans like that, you just, you want to take a break from the dating pool because people will waste your time you don't have time for that so i feel like when you go through certain things you date more with intention versus like just like superficial things like when you go through like a certain um experience in life especially when kids are involved you definitely date with more purpose and intention because you got kids to think about and you don't want them around like no cuckoos you know what i'm saying so yeah i'm just taking my time basically with the dating pool oh. and I, I just I don't have time for the shit okay. and the guys as you would say. Hey. Okay, so basically what you're saying, if you didn't have two babies, you would be out here in, in these streets. Mm, I wouldn't necessarily say that because I feel like as you even get older, your dating requirements and standards they shift, they change, they upgrade from when you're like. 20 something to like your 30s like you always want to do you always want to outdo the last relationship but you want to upgrade basically so i can't necessarily say just because i have kids i'll you know i'm not necessarily out in these streets i just don't have time for the oh i don't, I don't have time for it okay she I'm, got, I'm, I'm in my mid 30s now okay i'm not with the games and that's just on period so you think games got to do with age I wouldn't say games are associated with age, but I will say maybe like certain experiences oh. or, or, you know, a level of like maturity or immaturity and, you know, things like that. Like, I think, yeah, there could be people that are like in their early 20s that are like mature, but some people lack like emotional maturity and things mm. like that. I don't know. You know what I mean? Like, I know what you mean, but I don't totally agree. <laughs> Wild. Okay, you don't have to agree. Tell me your uh, outlook on it. Okay. Let me tell you some real gangster. Uh oh. Shh. Let me know, honey. I have friends, mm -hmm. okay, that I've known, and I hope they don't even watch this. Let's hope that girl. You know they're gonna watch it, depending on who it is, girl. girl well, okay. Oh well. And, uh, so I don't want nobody to be offended. So we ain't gonna say no names, hopefully. At right? all. Right. And if I do, Lena's gonna bleep them out. Oh. Okay. Okay. It's gonna be a. Okay, okay. Period. All right. And that's the 
about. So I have friends who consistently date a different name, same dude. Different, wait, say it again? Different, different name, same dude. Say that out loud. Say it out loud. I have friends uh -huh. that date different names. Oh, so they'll date like obviously different dudes, but yes. they have like the same characteristics. Absolutely. Okay. They don't learn. They don't. They don't learn from previous experience. Okay. Okay. You okay. understand what I'm saying? I, I hear so you. So when so when they date a dude with the F stuff, F boy. No, just with some that have the. F should What that mean, Brandisha? I'm trying not to curse on your on your blog, girl. When they have shit. Oh, F is F. <laughs> girl, you, you can't even spell that. How can I spell it? I'm gonna say F U K. Put the C in the middle, and well, be on that BS, basically. Yeah, yeah, but you know, but we don't say it's not the BS. I'm talking about it's worse than the BS. They be on that F. At the end of the day, it's like, I want my friends to call me when they're in distress. Right, But course. please don't call me about the same ratchet behavior time and time again. Right. Like, people, a, if the dude ain't about shit. Okay. Okay? I know, look, I'm not, look, let me tell you something. I've been with a dude that wasn't shit. Girl, I think we've all been there, child. Okay? But, and I've stayed. Mm -hmm. But the first dude I met that was with the shit. Okay. Okay? That was, I was praying to get the hell up out of that, okay? I was like, Brandy, Brandita, oh. wake up. Like, come out of come this. Come out of this, you, you know better. Place. I sure was, and that was before the movie, girl. Ooh. Okay, I would look in the mirror, because I knew better. I was like, girl. You had to have a conversation For with real, yourself. for real. Because I wasn't going to be doing no Jerry Springer type activity like, my man is. Right, 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 right. Oh, they no, be right honey. for them, them For ninjas. real, honey. Because, uh, 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 look, a girl could tell me one thing about my man, and I'm an off-top believer. Hey. Even if she lying. What? Oh, <laughs> Brandy, no, for real. girl. I know I you wear. No, I, I know you. Okay, okay. No, what I if she, God. like, hating and she I just don't trying give, to. I don't give a damn. Let me say something. If 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 I'm in a situation to where women are coming up to me talking about my man and stuff like that, that's somewhere I don't want to be. Right, 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 right. Period. Right, right, I don't right. care if it's his fault or not. Okay, because yeah, hey, Brandy, she girl damn. like that. Because because if, if, if I'm uncomfortable, right. Dang, Brandy. I don't give a damn. Like that, Brandy. My, my my man told me that. Because people can tell you anything. So to try to sabotage you. Absolutely. Now. And it could be, what if they trying to be like a hating friend and they like, well, I know Brandy thinks it and operates his way. So I'm going to intentionally tell her something about her man just so she'll like, you know, Wait. since you have that mindset. About oh, it, 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 I don't care. I, like I had a, I'm about to sip this because you know, this is some real stuff. Yes. Like I had an ex-boyfriend who said that he was like, you know, if I didn't. Oh, the ex told you that. Told you that. Yeah. he No, he didn't. This didn't happen to me. He said, somebody could tell Ooh. you. Dang, girl. <laughs> Shaking the table. This Back bitch is shaking one. the table. <laughs> Girl, I'm like, what the heck? I wasn't ready for that. That made me, that scared me. So you you was getting on me about, you know, me believing, you know, mm -hmm. what? Uh, a female over my man. Okay? Mm -hmm. I've been the, the friend, which I don't even do this no more, honestly. Right, 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 right. right. That I didn't see my friends' men's out in these streets, mm -hmm. and then you know it's them. They've been positively identified, and then you go and tell your friend, and then they be like, "Girl, are you sure it was him?" <laughs> That's how they do. They become the damsel in distress. They don't say, "Oh hell no." Girl. They're like, "Are you absolutely positive?" I be like, "I know that ninja." I done, see, I done been in your house 150, 11 times, girl. Girl. Okay. Then you tell them the information, right? Right, 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 right. Right? right? And then they don't confront the dude when the 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 evidence is hot and mm -hmm. warm and boiling. Right, right, right. They right, wait right. weeks later no, when they get into no, an argument. No, you can't wait. You, can't you know wait. what I mean? And then they want to be like, the Brandita tell me like, okay, first and foremost. Don't put my name in it, girl. girl. I was doing you a favor, okay? okay. And then you're going to wait. 
to tell the fool what I said when you should have said it on day Right, uno. right, numero uno. And so now the evidence is gone. What I told you he was wearing is gone, okay? Huh. It's up in the closet on the hanger, not in the dirty clothes the same right. days, that same right. night. Right, right. Okay, right, right. and then now you making you you over here trying to figure out what date it was because that day that I told you I seen him he didn't come on that night. Right. But now you can't even. Right. You can't even piece it together. You can't even piece it together. Mm mm. But anyways, go ahead, girl. girl I will not be so, with him. <laughs> I've only had to say that to one person. Mm. The crazy thing is that wasn't even my friend. Mm. This just was on some random I did that. stuff. I did that before. This was, I went to high school with this person. I know for a fact she ain't watching this video. <laughs> and even the person I told that it happened to, I know ain't gonna watch my video because I know they don't watch my stuff. So, um, I was coming back from Vegas, right? Oh, this sounded like this was recent. It was this. It was this year. It was in the summer. Oh, dang, great. Yes, girl. This summer, summer, summer time. This is new juice. This is new. Oh, this is 2022 new. Okay, go ahead. I was coming back from Vegas, y'all. Mm -hmm. On a little Southwest flight, you know. Boarding my flight. And as I'm sitting in my seat, okay? <laughs> I see this guy walking on the plane, right? Mm. I see him walking on the plane. Mind you, I'm only seeing this guy only on social media. I don't know this man from a can of paint. Um... SF is extremely, extremely small. So Period. if you follow some of the similar people, I guarantee they're gonna pop up. They gonna pop up. SF is small. Okay, mm -hmm. he knows some of the people that I know. I went to high school with his girlfriend, baby mama. I don't even know what it is because I don't even know if she even confronted him about it when I said something. Mm. So, mm. and I'm not even friends with the girl. I just we follow each other on Instagram. We went to school together, but we ain't friends. Mm -hmm. So when I seen him. First, I was thinking to myself, oh, there goes such and such um, mm -hmm. boyfriend. Mm -hmm. I thought she was going to be behind him, y'all. <laughs> it wasn't her. It wasn't her, y'all. Mm. It was not her. It mm. was a different female. Jesus. And clearly, he don't like black girls because oh, 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 even oh. the girl he was with, I ain't going to even say nationality because I might give it away, but she was of an, um, you know, she wasn't white either, but. She was the an girl, exotical. Yes, yeah, the girl he was on the plane with was the same or similar ethnicity as his uh, baby mama girlfriend, whoever. An exotical. Okay. So when I seen her, I actually thought it was the girl that I went to school with. I was like, oh, that's such and such. And when I looked, I was like, hold on. That's not her. Ooh. I was like, hold on. What are the odds that we're on the same exact flight? leaving vegas going back to the bay area right who <laughs> i have a better rapport with her homegirl so i hit up her homegirl mind you i took a small video too i forgot to say that see that you had to I, prove i have to prove you had to prove because i was like should. hold on like i took a quick snap of him like mm. putting his bags on i only got a piece of her and but i knew it wasn't i knew it wasn't his girlfriend that she'd be like posting on her page and stuff like that right <laughs> you see how never mind let me stop let me yeah. stop so anywho i hit up i was marinating on the evidence for like a day because mm -hmm. i was trying to decide like mm -hmm. i'm not a friend like mm -hmm. but I, well, I just can't stand when men just be like just doing f you know doing the dump the dump the bs you know what i'm saying so i was like i gotta tell her so I hit up her, her one of her best friends. I have a better rapport with her best friend, right? Hit up her best friend through DMs on Instagram and just was like, hey girl, um, I feel more comfortable letting you know this information. Me and such and such, obviously we're not friends like that. And you can do with whatever you choose with the info, but I just feel like I have to let you know because I just hate when dudes be cheating on women, some, some, something. So, and mind you, it, maybe he wasn't cheating. It could have been like a work trip, whatever, but either way, it just didn't seem my my woman's intuition is telling me he was doing something else in Vegas on that trip, and she was like, "Well, was it just them two? Was it the group people?" See, see, see. This is her friend asking questions. Oh, okay. Her okay. friend, not uh, the oh, not the okay. girlfriend. Okay. And I was like, it appeared for it to just be them two, and I was like, I have video. You want, you want me to send you the video? Mm -hmm. So I sent her a video of them getting on the plane together, and I sent her a video of them walking through the airport once we landed mm -hmm. in um, an SFO mind you this is another thing uh, when we had landed her hood had went on right because i feel like yeah maybe she could have been cold 
maybe mm -hmm. but they were walking in the distance and i feel like since they were back home they didn't want to run into nobody so if someone were to like see him they wouldn't notice her they would just see him they wouldn't mm -hmm. even think about that's what i thought because i'm like now y'all walking with distance between y'all yeah y'all over here being yeah mm -hmm. okay. a little bit less Y'all yeah. trying to be incognito now mm -hmm. that you're back in the city. You feel mm -hmm. me? She had her hood on. I want to say she was walking a few steps behind him. And he was walking more ahead of her. And he and she was like on her phone. Basically acting like just people in the airport walking around. So I got a, a quick clip of them doing that. And um, they went up to the, um, the area where you like park your cars and stuff like that. It's like the parking lot. So I sent her friend that evidence. And her friend was just like, damn. And I was just like, yeah, girl, I don't know. I, you know, I, I'm i just sending you this, whatever. But I, I don't know what happened with that. But that was just crazy because I've never been in a situation where I've seen somebody. And let me know what y'all would have done. Like, even though I don't know the guy, I'm not even friends with the girl. But we follow each other on Instagram and she be posting him. <laughs> that's, like, why, that's why sometimes don't, don't, uh, don't keep posting your dude. I know that's your baby daddy, your baby mama, but people get embarrassed doing that type of stuff, like for real. And sometimes I feel like when people overpost they mates like that, I say overpost, you could post them, but overpost, I feel like they trying to prove something or tell the world uh -huh. because they know, they know that they do it or they, I'm gonna say do because we talk from women's perspective right, right, right. and about she right right i didn't i didn't think about it like that oh absolutely when people like over post oh no they yeah. over post because they are trying to piss on the fire hydrant <laughs> <laughs> oh that's what it's called girl so yeah so that was that so i've never experienced like me having to hit up an actual friend of mine but that was just so random that i seen this guy on the, on my flight and he was with another female it definitely was not the girl i went to high school with like i said she ain't my friend but we do follow each other on social media so i just felt like my woman duty was to like say something to her like i just don't like that <laughs> girl i wouldn't say shit you wouldn't have said nothing oh, absolutely not Dang, i would have told really? my friend just for the gossip no girl i don't mean i don't, like i said i don't even tell my friends when they do just doing something oh absolutely like not I don't. It, I, it depends on what, whose friend, what friend it is. I, like I said, I don't even waste my time. Yeah, because sometimes it is a way. It is. A it way. is because all they gonna do is not believe it, question it, yeah. and stay with the fool, and then you wasted your time. Yeah. And then somebody might be beefing with you. Yeah, that's you true. You know what I mean. That's so true. I don't even waste. I don't even waste my time. You yeah. know what I mean. So it's kind of like, um. Cause you know it is. Cause half the time they know when they they do they this. do this doing some mm -hmm. crazy stuff. Yeah, yeah. I'm sure this probably wasn't the first time. Y'all trying to come on? Mm -hmm. We got the eyeball out. Okay, this is what <laughs> she's giving so far, girl. She got one out. Okay, she got the hole right here. <laughs> girl, carving pumpkin shell, getting you know. messy. Like so. You kind of talked about this earlier. We was talking about the grills. So yeah, we were just like having some chat, some mm -hmm. chatter, mm -hmm. and just happened to say like, okay, I'm all for folks getting a hygiene together, okay? Mm -hmm. That girl, hygiene is, it gotta be on point. But when people be getting these, um, like veneers i don't it's like are y'all going to the same doctor yes, is your are. doctor not telling you hey these teeth are not the size for your mouth like please get them white i want to get my white but baby why is your teeth bigger than your mouth like it don't make sense to me it don't make sense like why the teeth coming out the mouth okay so i'm gonna let y'all know this it. Okay, a few things y'all done got your ppp loans and stuff y'all done got bbls <laughs> and teeth no, that's some real legit ass. Not BBLs and teeth, Brandy. Girl, you got BBLs and teeth. <laughs> I'm done. I can't. This child said BBLs and teeth. And okay. Teeth. And like, I, look, check this out. I'm not mad at it, but let me tell you something. Y'all be going to these foreign countries to get mm. these BBLs. Okay. And Speak teeth. On it. And teeth. Girl. Now, I want my teeth white, but your teeth, can you pass me your pamphlet over there? Oh, yeah, go ahead. Yeah, go. I, just, I just need the go. pamphlet real fast. Your teeth, this, I'm going to use the Girl, you, that. Yes, I thought I you could use it for oh, the girl, pumpkin. No, absolutely not, honey. Your teeth ain't supposed to be this white. Let me see. Girl. Your teeth, this is not natural mm -mm. for the human body. Mm -mm. Your egg whites. 
ain't mm. even this. Okay, white. they not. The the thing in your eye is not. Okay. Your teeth are not. The okay. Cornea? They're the uh, I think the cornea is the middle, baby. That's the pupil. No, the pupil is it's the dot. thing. But this is not What's the, the cornea. Part called? I don't know. The yeah. eyeball. The eyeball. <laughs> okay. okay, that. So um so at the end of the day, when you want teeth like this, please don't do it. It's unnatural. It's weird. Okay. Okay. Blinding me when you crack a smile. For real. For real. And then people get confused because now they everybody feel like their teeth should look. 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 Girl, that's a mess. No, look. How that look against my skin? A mess. How that look against my skin? Girl, the contrast. I can't do it. Girl. <laughs> mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Second. I need that little black. Smell. Oh, oh, here you go. Thank you. Okay. Second, the teeth, okay? Like, I don't know if y'all know this, but if you get your teeth done, make sure you have money just in case you break them. Mm. Because they're not real. Right. They have to shave your tooth down yeah. underneath to put that in your mouth. Yeah. Okay, and a lot of times people have to get those replaced and redone. It's like it's like a cap in your mouth. Something. It's like a cavity. Like some people crack their cavity, you know, like like their fillings and yeah, stuff. That's true, Teeth yeah. work the same way. Yeah. So what you gonna do if you got that done in Brazil or the Dominican Republic okay. and then you ain't got no more money because you got it from a PPP loan. Girl. Girl. I just don't get why they get them so big. Like I, I don't think they intend to do that. I think it's just the because, doctor needs to tell them. Like, well, Look. girl, honey, when you go to like the Dominican Republic or these little side places, mm -hmm. right? They over here, they girl, they about their money. They doing like this. They this this how they doing. They they doing like they they installing them. They on the next person. They install them. This the next person. They right, install right, them. Right. Honey, it is straight. Uh, uh, we call it a belt when you work in a, a factory. A conveyor, a conveyor belt or a, no, no, oh, no, uh, a, uh, a a assembly. Factory. Line. Yep, that's what y'all ask to them. So you think that <laughs> you think, line. So when people get them done, some people spend a lot of money to go to the right doctors and stuff. So yeah. you know, because usually if you go to the right place, honey, they giving you, they take a picture of you, they they do a measurement, and they they put the teeth in your mouth fakely, you know, like so you can generate them onto your TV. Like okay, right. like, this is what it will look like if you want this size. You know, they do the whole kitten girl. <laughs> What? I'm just looking at Lita doing this. <laughs> Lita, how you got rectangles or squares and then you got... Because I saw y'all, I thought they was cute. I said, I need to do that. Oh, that's that. not bad though, actually. They don't look bad. Child, it don't look bad. Look at the smile look all crooked. Girl, it's okay, girl. My, look, I got a uh, pin on mine. Girl. And let's talk about BBLs. Ooh! Child. Let's talk about the BBLs. The fact that they're going out of style because people too many people got removed. Yep, yeah, well the people that can afford to. Because everybody yeah, oh, can't yeah, everybody afford, can afford to. to get it removed, yeah. Absolutely not. Yeah. You know what I mean? I think they just take like some meat from somewhere else in your body and put it in the butt, right? Is that how it works? They usually people is fat transfer. Usually yeah, from fat transfer. Yeah. So they just stomach. take some of the fat some, out the some, butt. Some but some people don't have a lot of fat to transfer so they get like the the extra like silicone mm -hmm. version. So you have the the people that go to the hotel that get it pumped in their butts and they don't know what it is. Girl. No, that's it's, it's a thing. And then you got the ones that if you go to a doctor, it's fat transfer. That's why people walk out with a flat stomach and a big ass. Mm. Mm -hmm. So it depends on who you going. If you go into Shaquita up the street, Shaquita then up it's the street, something child. in a plunger that they put in your butt. But if you're going to, you know, right. Dr. Miami, then it's a fat transfer. Yeah. I mean, I get it. Some people don't be like, you know, happy about their body. So they do like these different like body modifications. Hey, by all means, do what you do. But I feel like if you're going to do something like that, at least make it look natural. I mean, unless you want to look like, you know. Uh, like my mom calls them. She be like, you be looking like an anime character. Yeah, that. Or like an ant or something like the big butt and the tiny waist. It's like, do what you do. Proportional. Yeah, I don't get why they don't want it to look like as natural. It's like they, I don't know, child. Well, all I know is I'm not. I, look, I, if I could afford some plastic surgery, I would. Cause I would get my stomach sucked out. I would. I want to. I want to breast lift. Girl, I need one too. My titties is gang Selena too, girl. And I ain't got no kids. <laughs> my shit looking sorry. It's like, ah, she said, mine is gang Selena. And I ain't got no kids. Girl, I'm done girl, with you. Girl, honey. Just done. cause they real titties. Girl. But anywho. <laughs> okay, so I'm very proud of this. I'm going to give this to Layla. Oh, 
don't. And, and I'm gonna tell you why. I will tell you why. Okay, that's one of the twins. I love them both. I call them Lay Lang. Okay, that's Layla and Langston. And I'm gonna give this to Layla because let me tell you something. Layla be give, showing me some love. Langston should be showing me neither. Y'all don't judge. I ain't carved the pumpkin in I don't know when. Damn, girl. Girl, what? the mouth is crooked. She is bleeding. What the hell is it? Girl, well, hold up. No, she ain't even bleed. She done blew his, <laughs> blew his brains out. Look at this. This is brain matter. <laughs> that is brain matter. Bernisha. Bro, this is brain matter. Girl, I did the best I could. No, girl, I'm talking about all right here. You don't see this? Girl, I just girl, just put her back in. <laughs> Girl, just put her back in. <laughs> and then Brandy's hat is tilting like TI's. Okay, girl. because we black in here. We we we, we you know it's tilting. Cricket and that's just that's, that's that, that, that. that. Well y'all, thank you for joining us during our pumpkin carving girl talk session. Give it up for the homie, the Robert and Dita, and that's just on period. Apologize because your girl has not been as consistent as I should have been this month. <laughs> I wasn't fully prepared for Vlogtober. I didn't know what I was getting myself into, okay? But it don't matter because y'all getting this video today and that's what matters. We're in the present and that's just all of that. Well, anywho, with that being said, please don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Make sure you follow the homie, all that good stuff. And until next time, we out. Peace. Mama say, Mama sign with my goose, Mama say, Mama sign with my goose,